we're going to step in, in the concept of subgroup generated by S. In this video, I'm going to be explaining what is this theorem, what is subgroup generated by S. And in the next video, I'm going to give you the proof of it. So let's get started. So first off, the theorem for any subset S of a group G, there is a smallest subgroup of G denoted like this, containing S. It consists all finite products of elements of S and their inverses. So, let's say now you have a group G and if you pick subset of G randomly, it's not going to form a group which is subgroup of G. But if you can expand it to the extent where it forms a subgroup, then we call it subgroup generated by S and it forms a group. And also means if you've got other subgroup of G that contains S, we call it H, then in fact subgroup generated by S should be a subgroup of H. In other words, if you have subgroup of G sandwiched between S and G, and then you can always say subgroup generated by S is a subgroup of H. So literally, subgroup generated by S is literally a smallest subgroup of G that containing S. <laughs> 